Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I have a little bit of an updated apartment tour. So let's get into it. So this is actually a very exciting step because yes, I did move out of the other apartment, which that video got a decent amount of views. And so thank you all for taking a look at that. Um, but I had three, three roommates in that apartment. I had a bad roommate situation and now I have my own place. No roommates. So uh, let's take a look. All right, so this is when you enter in. This is what you're graded by. Now, these windows are very big. I think these ceilings are taller than in my last apartment. And I mean, all the natural lights coming in. These are also west facing windows. This is the kitchen. Um, what I really like is they put recessed lights here. Not every floor plan has this, but this one does. They also put an accent wall on here to give it a little bit of contrast. Um, one thing I'm not crazy about is the wall has texture, kind of like a little bit of a knockdown pattern. It's not the end of the world, but that's one thing I'm not crazy about. Thermostats right here. Um, fire alarm circuit breaker, which is such a horrible spot to put that it's so ugly. Um, but we have the bathroom here. This is all different color. Um, and then this is the shower, which is just a huge upgrade from my last place. Um, it has like a Bluetooth shower head moxie thing. So a little bit of a gimmick. I honestly think it's a little unnecessary, but it's pretty cool. I'm just excited to have a walk-in shower. I never used my bathtub except for like when I took ice baths, you know, for recovery. And sometimes like I, I took a bath like twice, I think in two years that I lived there. So moving on, they actually gave me a little gift basket with toilet paper, dishwasher capsules. Looks like an essential oil thing. Very cool. This sink is huge. It's a farmhouse sink. Pretty nice attachment as well. And it actually has pretty good water pressure as well. So that will be nice. Um, you have dishwasher. This is a way nicer one than at the standard, which is where I lived before. Standard fridge. Um, microwave. This is, I think, the exact same microwave I had. Yeah, no. This kitchen's way, way better because... It, the microwave is so much taller and well, at 5'8", a bit of a reach. However, it feels so much more spacious in here. Um, then this is laundry. So they're stacked. Then over here we have the living space. Comes with this couch. I actually really like the color on it. Um, and these windows are huge. West facing as well. So we'll get sunsets at night. Um, then we have a TV here. This is a 55 inch TV with this beautiful mid-century modern TV stand. So that's really nice. Then these coffee tables, I'm not crazy about them, but they'll do the trick for now. And then we have the bedroom, which is really, really small, but this is it. Window, blackout shades, instead of those horrible blinds. So that's really nice. Huge walk-in closet. Now this is the biggest upgrade from my last place is the closet. I had a really small closet in my last place and this is a huge, huge, huge upgrade. And I'm very, very happy to have a walk-in closet finally. Um, and this kind of takes away from this tiny bedroom. I'm gonna probably move some things around. Also, a lot of things are gonna be done to this apartment. So let me talk about that. This apartment's gonna have a lot of changes done. The first thing I'm gonna do is actually change out these handles. Um, I'm gonna make them black. I'm not crazy about the silver. It looks fine, but it's not kind of what I'm going for exactly. And then I'm thinking about changing the color of these walls um, to a dark gray or black. I, don't, I think black might be a little too harsh, but I really like dark spaces and I just think it would look super nice um, and then I'm gonna make this accent wall here a darker color as well. So I'm very excited to do that. Um, I'm also thinking about putting a dining room table here with two chairs just to kind of take away from this thing because it has bar stools and I don't like bar stools. This is nice though, actually. Um, and I can use this as a kitchen island for prepping, which will be really nice. Um, and I'm thinking about maybe putting a very small sideboard here. It's just gonna be a little tricky with the kitchen cabinets opening right here. So I'll have to do some measurements to make sure everything works properly. But yeah, this is it. It is a 
523 square feet or 528, give or take a couple square feet. Um, in this building, this is actually the largest floor plan, which blows my mind because it's not that big, but I'm very pleased with my decision and I cannot wait to show you an updated apartment tour. So that's it, not very long video. Uh, and thank you all for watching. Have a good rest of your day.